In the summer of 1997, scientists heard something that would haunt the ocean research community for decades. A sound so massive, so unexplainable, it could only be given one name, the bloop. Picture this, the South Pacific Ocean off the coast of South America. Scientists are monitoring underwater volcanoes using sophisticated hydrophones. Basically, underwater microphones that can pick up sounds from thousands of miles away. Then it happened. A ultra-low frequency sound unlike anything they'd ever recorded. This wasn't just any sound. This was one of the loudest underwater sounds ever captured by human technology. The recording lasted somewhere between 30 seconds to a full minute, depending on which report you read. Here's where it gets wild. The sound pattern was similar to marine animal calls, but amplified to an absolutely terrifying degree. Even the largest animal we know, the blue whale, couldn't produce anything close to this volume. So what could? The scientists were genuinely stumped. The depth, the frequency, the sheer power of this sound suggested something massive was down there. Some researchers hypothesized it could be an unknown species of giant squid, a prehistoric creature we thought was extinct, or even something we'd never imagined existed. Remember, we've explored less than 5% of our oceans. The deepest parts remain more mysterious than outer space. The Mariana Trench alone could hide creatures the size of skyscrapers, and we'd never know. The bloop came from these depths. For years, the bloop fueled endless theories. Message boards exploded with speculation. Was it Cthulhu waking up? A military experiment gone wrong? An underwater alien base? The government staying suspiciously quiet only made things worse. But here's the thing about mysteries. Sometimes the truth is stranger than fiction. Sometimes it's more mundane. And sometimes it's both. The bloop mystery was about to take several unexpected turns. Hit that follow button because what scientists discovered next will blow your mind. Part two drops tomorrow.